Cool niggas, you should try to clown me. I'm gone. They see me blowing up. Now they say they want some. Queen's MC Lil Tecca has gone from local rapper to online sensation with a placement on the Hot 100 all in a matter of months. And his sudden rise has been pretty impressive. Like, I don't care what no one thinks anymore. I'm just gonna do me now. You feel me? If people like it, they like it. If they don't, they don't. I like it. But before Lil Tecca was rising up the charts, he dipped his toe into the rap game first around the age of nine. I started rapping because of Xbox. Like, really? Yeah. Like my first, like one of my first friends on Xbox, we was just chilling and we, we used to always roast each other. So I was like, nah, I'm about to make a song on you. My first song was a diss track to my friend. The song has since been deleted, but it sparked Tekka's early interest in music, along with musical influences like Chief Keef and the melodies of the late Speaker Knockers, who Genius covered earlier this year. In late 2017, Tekka and a friend released No More on SoundCloud, which helped usher in his online presence. And the block got so high, I can't keep a glot no more. All my niggas with the shares, we can't sell no rock no more. As his music picked up steam over the course of 2018, he also got involved in some online beef with Toronto rapper LB, after a Canadian music page accused Tekka of lifting the rapper's flow, but Tekka saw the dispute as an opportunity. So boom, six months, he DMs me, he's like, you're getting exposed tonight. I'm like, I bet, let's get some clout. <laughs> he, po he posts me on the page, he's like, he plays LB song, then he plays my song. Right, I remember like, that. Bet. It's perfect. Yeah. I start going crazy, I post a preview on my page, I go live, I start adding niggas, I'm like, these niggas all sound the same, so I'm gonna just try to sound like them. They have like these real funny accents. So like, I, like, you feel me? I use the accent and then they all get mad. It's funny. Family, ting alive. Like they just be going crazy. The beef only helped him get bigger. And as his follower count grew, so did his discography with tracks like Love Me consistently breaking a million views on YouTube. In January, 2019, he dropped his standout track, Did It Again, which was one of his first songs to really blow up. In an interview, Tekka described his versatility saying, quote, if I had to describe my music to a new listener, I would just say all of my songs would fit a different crowd. If you don't fuck with the first one you hear, you might fuck with another one heavy. I got a pack, hit him and do it again. Fuckin' I'm fuckin' a friend. I got bands, when they are flying to friends, drinking till a nigga land. After the music video for Did It Again dropped in March, views on the Genius Song page tripled as the video garnered millions of views. Songs like Molly Girl also kept Tekka's popularity on the rise. But in May, fresh off the heels of his viral releases, Tekka collaborated with Cole Bennett of Lyrical Lemonade to release a music video for Ransom set in the Dominican Republic. I heard the beat, it was like dun, dun, dun. I was like, yeah, it's it. I heard the beat drop, I was like, whoa, yeah, this is like in a whole different universe. I got black, I got white, what you want? Hop outside a ghost and hop up in a fan, on. Uh. I know I'm about to blow, whoa, whoa, I ain't dumb. They try to take my floor, I take their ass for Ransom. The video was a hit almost immediately, with over 20 million views on YouTube to date. Usually, I don't pick the name of the song till after the song, so I kept going, I kept listening to it, what should I name it, what should I name it, and then I heard me say Ransom, and I was just like, Ransom. In mid-June, Ransom jumped onto the Billboard Hot 100 chart, giving Tekka his very first Hot 100 hit and only 16 years old. And while Tekka's popularity continues to grow, he's still managed to balance his life as a teenager with a budding rap career, and plans to keep riding this wave. I've been in the studio for like nine months. Nine months straight? Yeah, because I know what good music sounds like. Yeah. So I just go to the studio and try to make it. I'm Tia with Genius News, bringing you the meaning and the knowledge behind the music. Thank <laughs> you.